Hi there, welcome to something of everything. In this video, we will learn about giving design parameters for concrete design instead. For that, you have to select design and go to concrete. It will give you the window that in which you have to define the code, give the parameters, select the parameters from the values, and give the commands of design. Okay. So this is our structure where we want to give the design parameters which are the parameters available in the design for design for giving. So brace type of bracing clear distance from the surface member to the reinforcement. This is the command for giving the cover. We have depth of cross sections to be used for design. If S distance of any section from the end node. ELY, ELZ, that is member length factor about local Y and Z axis. This needs to be given where your beam is of the whole length, but instead it is discreted, that is, it is cutted at some point nodes. In that case, we have to give the total long length of the beam for design or column for design. At that point of time, you have to use this ELY and ELZ command. We will give you an elaborated video about how to give ELY and Z. Then S, S1, S command. It has two parameters of 0 and 1. It checks the length by depth ratio of the beams kind of check. FC, concrete strength of. <coughs> FI main, FI secondary, main and secondary steel yield strengths, maximum main, maximum bar dia, maximum secondary bar dia, MD1, MD2. These are bar combinations that needs to that is to be taken for design. Method, method, whether to consider minimum eccentricity or not. M phase, design moment for flexural at S phase, that is at the phase of structure. We have to give two more, two or three commands to design the structure at the face. Minimum, main and secondary, bad ass, M main, MAG, vector for which you want to design the structure. You can factorize the moments being calculated from analysis. Ratio, maximum percentage of reinforcement to be provided in the structure, above which it will show that the structure goes, the element goes fails. Range select either tied or spiral columns. Range distance of start and end point of the structure. Remember, R phase. Mm, R phase means if you don't provide the R phase, it takes, it designs columns such as reinforcement is being provided equally in all the four parts from the center cut. R phase 2, 3 means it is being given local y and local z directions two in only two directions two phase reinforcement four phase reinforcement kind of things as far as distance of section from start node sp main torsion torsion is better to consider the torsional effect of the structure or in the element design track zero one two zero means minimal information being printed in the output file one means a bit more than minimum and two means all the moments, forces, and design results in the output file. UL, Y, and Z, unsupported length of factor 4 in Y and Z direction, where the width of process to be used in the design. Okay, this all the parameters will be in the available. You have to take that. If you don't want some of the parameters, you can remove it so that it doesn't bother you when you are, you are defining the parameters. Okay, then the next step is to define the parameters. We forget to tell you about the first step that is to select the code which code you want to use for this. In our case, it is IS456. Okay, now let's define the parameters for. We don't want to give the bracings. Okay, let's give clear. What does it shows? Distance from surface of member to edge of the outermost reinforcement. That means clear cover. 
तो कॉलम लेट से फोर पॉइंट फोर फोर बीन लेट से इट्स पॉइंट थर्टी फाइव पॉइंट थ्री ओके बाय डिफॉल्ट इट विल गेट पॉइंट जीरो थ्री वैल्यू डेप्थ टू बी यूज्ड इन द डिजाइन बाय डिफॉल्ट आई विल टेक इफ वी आर प्रोवाइडिंग जीरो इट विल टेक द नंबर प्रॉपर्टी साइज if s we don't want to give it at this point of time we don't want to give el y and z at this point of time we are showing you the basic parameters that needs to be given to the structure while designing a acc structure if you want to use more parameters you can if you want to use less parameters you can but these are the basic load parameters uh, design parameters i am using Hence, perform shear check against enhanced shear strength as per clause forty point five of IS four five six. Let's say one two not to work. Concrete strength twenty five. Steel strength four one five. Secondary also four one five. Maximum and battery is there. Thirty to the maximum secondary twelve the method one consider as per as per process minimum eccentricity clause minimum man by twelve the minimum secondary eight the ratio needs to be four four columns two four beams whether to design the beams for torsion or neglect the torsion effect. Take zero one two. Let's give torsion. Let's neglect the tor effect of torsion. Let's put all the data in the output file. And post these different parameters. After defining par defining the parameters, we have to give the commands for designing the beam and designing the coil. Okay. Now it's time to give these parameters, assign these parameters to the elements. For assigning the parameters to the column, just select beams parallel to Y. On you selected objects only, so that you can give all the column design parameters to the columns only. We have point zero four four columns. Yes, we have to assign it. Hence one, you have to assign it. Twenty four F C F Y man by second any word assigned to you. What this is saying that you have chosen this method is being shown in the Here you have to do the yes, yes, yes. Method one: minimum eccentricity to be taken for designing the columns. Minimum bar diameter. Yes, you fold four columns. Track torsion is not to be given to the columns. Track two and design column parameters. Okay. Now that you have given the parameters to the column, all you have to give the do is you have to select the view columns, and by inverse you have to select the beams. Go to view, you select the objects only. Now all the parameters are being given to the beams only. Select a center view, and one to be given to the beams also. F C to be given to the beams also. Likewise, if I main, if I secondary, maximum main, maximum secondary. The third is not to be given to the beams. Minimum main to be given. Minimum secondary is to be given. Ratio two for beams. Torsion need to be neglected. For beam design and design beam, this is what we have given to the structure. Now let's analyze the structure. Now the structure will analyze, will be analyzed and designed also. It will take some time in designing. It has started the concrete design. It is starting. It is printing the warnings. We will see what the warnings are for. 
let's go to the output file the warnings will be construction files the beams are failing because the enforcement percentage is being increased about 2 the columns are failing because the enforcement percentage ex exceeds the maximum limit ok so these are the commands you have to give for designing the structure concrete structure you can give other parameters too you can learn from there all the parameters from the help file just write concrete sorry concrete design it will show the using parameters mm, we are not getting the actual thing we want to let's write a four five six and see what the design parameters okay these are the design parameters as good four five six these are all the parameters being explained to you in the help file Let's see what the ENS was doing. Perform CL check against enhance CL check as per IS purposes. Lost this. Hence, one means ordinary CL check to be performed. And for other values, the program can let to overload the pressure. And if it is present and something like that. If you give zero, it will give you lots of warnings of this not being satisfied it's up to you what commands you want to give what parameters you want to give just learn these parameters and give as per your requirements thank you for watching us keep watching and sharing something of everything videos thank you do subscribe to our channel also